Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to quickly lower your input delay by installing the Intelligent List Standby Cleaner. So I'm going to have a link in the description. If you copy and paste that into the search bar, it's going to come up. And then you'll see Intelligent Standby List Cleaner. You're going to want to scroll all the way down to official download here. And I'm actually going to download it because I uninstalled it just so I could show you guys. And it's such a small file, it already downloaded. So I'm going to right click and go show in folder. And then I'm going to go ahead and extract here. And then this is the folder right here. So if you double click on that, you have it right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to exit out of the browser and then drag this to my desktop. That way it's right here. So if you open this up, you're going to want to, you want, you don't want to delete any of these files. You need these three to have it run properly. So you just double click and you see how mine opened up automatically. So sometimes it's not going to open up automatically like that. So you're going to have to uh, double click on it in the tray here. So for instance, if it doesn't open up, you just double click on the little green screen right here and then it'll come up. But anyways, from here, if you can't type anything in here yet, you want to hit stop and then you'll have access to type in here. So the list size is at least, you want to leave that at 1024. For the free memory is lower than, this is going to be different for everyone. So for me, I have 32 gigs of RAM, so you want to do half of that, which is 16,000. Well, 32,000 megabytes, so 16,000. So for you, if you have 16, you want to set it to 8,000, 8,000, you want to set it to 4,000, and so on. Okay, and then I usually don't launch it on the logon because I don't like using the task scheduler, so I just leave it minimized. So I hit start ISLC minimized. And then you want to check this enable custom timer resolution and you want to set it to 0 0.50 and then delete the zeros all after it so it's at 0 0.50. And then like I said, this stays at 1024 and then this is half of your system memory. So my total memory right here is the 32683. So you just round it, round it to the even number. So like I said, it's 32,000. So for me, it's 16,000. 16,000. 16, and then the polling rate, you want to mess with this on your own. You, you never want to set it to anything other than 500, 1,000, or 10,000. So most videos will show you 10,000, but I do not like how it feels with 10,000. I usually leave it at 500 to 1,000. I've been leaving it at 500 lately, and it's felt really good. So what you want to do then is hit stop again. If it doesn't do anything, then just press start and then purge standby list. And then you'll minimize this while you play. And then it's right here. If you need it, you double click and it's right here. And you just minimize it. And there you go, guys. That'll 100% lower your input delay. And I hope this helped, guys. Like and subscribe and stay tuned for another video soon. Peace out, guys.